So the first question asked to us was, how does this lesson plan template provide differ from others you've seen? Um, I haven't seen too many other lesson plans before, but I used to be a preschool teacher and ours were much simpler. We just had to write down the activity we will be doing for the week and connect them to the learning elements that needed to be implemented. But looking at this lesson plan, this is what I expected a normal K through 12 lesson plan to look like. Like I said, the difference between my preschool lesson plan and this lesson plan is this one is a lot more in depth of what you'll be teaching and you have to connect it to so many more things. Not only do you have to connect it to the students, you have to connect it to the teacher as well. Uh, this lesson plan is essentially like a roadmap for the lesson you will be teaching. I like this because specifying concrete objective, objectives for your students um, will help you determine what kind of learning activities and strategies you will use for your class. I also really like how this lesson plan covers so much, not just what you're going to be teaching, but how you're going to introduce it, what strategies you will be using, and why your students will be engaged and interested in that lesson. Um, the other types of lesson plans I have seen are like the daily lesson plan, the weekly, which is how I did it for my preschool. Um, there's also the whole unit, which can take anywhere from two weeks to two months for teachers to teach and assess, or there's by grade level. Um, the second question that was asked was, what elements do you think will be find challenging and provide um, a response? So the elements I find to be challenging in the lesson plan are going to be the teaching professional standards, the INTASC, the ISTEs, and the TPEs. Um, also, the diverse learning section and understanding the difference between like the learning abilities and capabilities of students. The reason I think professional standards are going to be hard is because the INTASC, the ISTEs, and TPEs are all new to me. Um, it's going to take me a minute for me to get used to them and learn how to con connect them to my lesson plan properly. But I feel once I do it a few times, I'm going to get the hang of it. Um, as long, along with the diverse learning section, I feel this may be a little hard for me because I've never had to work with these types of students, so I'm not sure exactly what types of strategies um, I will be doing. But for instance, like a student may be good at math but not good at reading. So with this, I will prioritize relationship buildings with my students and show them that it's okay and I will be, for their, be there for them the whole way. Um, and I want to help them succeed even though they have some learning disabilities or uh, capabilities. Though this is all new to me, I'm so excited to be learning about teaching and all the things to come with it and the learning the correct way to do lesson plans. All of this is making me so excited to have my own classroom one day.